MVP. Can you fare a little bit better? I mean, it's the placement isn't too bad, Martin, but we've got to be honest and we have to say it. They must be kicking themselves now. That is home territory. That is home turf. They turned away from it ever so slightly, but they just split their resources so damn thin. Like, that's... You can't be at their, at their level. It's not something that we anticipate and probably why I'm driving it home a little bit more than what I should. It's just not something that you let teams get away from and get away with. And VP is a team that, yeah, they just got simply got caught with the pants down. Yeah, they, they obviously wanted to keep that spot for themselves. They know coming out of that red brick, brick uh, gym there is, is uh, yeah, it's super good. You're able to to take a lot of control. You have a lot of entry points. You can cover a lot. It has two levels as well. So that's why they stuck two guys down there to make sure if this circle went in that direction that they wanted to, to hold on to that. But yeah, you get contested. And, and that's one of the other things, right? You can play the game so well, but you're never in control of what the other teams decide to do. And a, and a full four-man crash from Liquid is going to be extremely hard to defend us too. So yeah, they're obviously quite sad of it. But up until that point, the decisions was correct. They were doing all the right things. So it's uh, it's it's outside stuff that is... We'll see if it pays off. It did last time round. We'll see if this one becomes so fruitful. Maxi's disconnected from the rest of the team. But Tulin's Hawkey, instantly confirmed and killed. We at least know it's going to be going to the northwest. Apocalypse, first strike onto Hell Story, gone. Removed and eliminated eli instantly. Tries to bank him from the back wall. Honor finally found, so makes it a little bit easier for Liquid. Looks like they're getting the hell out of here with two players left remaining in the vehicle, and away we go. Regroup with the rest of the roster, get deeper inside the circle. There's still oh. a few player. Never mind. I stand completely corrected altogether. Clip, however, has paid the price and lost his life. The rest of them will now commit to the cause and get inside. Ibi down and dead as well. They really want to get get rid of him here in the northwestern side. They wanna they wanna hold Oh, oh that's a really good nade onto Alia. Yeah, that's that's gonna hurt him. Now the rest of them will have to kind of rally around that and work the way forward. I'm just trying to see what kind of angle quiz he's gonna have as he heads over this one. Is that Molly gonna go inside or it just bounced a little bit too far? Actually hit the top of the shack and he is burning, so it's clipped him. It's transferred on the floor. Oh that is an impeccable, impeccable Molly. Denies the front door and now continues onwards. Instantly, hello, my bad is removed from play. Now they go for the nades. Now they have some sort of rough information where these will be lurking. That's going to be good. That's going to oh be God. absolutely frigging awesome. So much damage is done. If there's a follow-up on there, that will be two players down bad. He can continue to hold this, though. With the flashbang follow-up, they might just catch him on the back lines of this one. Get your gun out, my dude, because you're going to have players knocking on the door rather shortly. Falls back. Navi's there, at least. Certainly ones that are close to try and give him some sort of support, but never mind. Nuki from the distance makes this so much easier for Quizzy. As all he has to do is find the Wanderer laying on the floor. Just cop for him on the back. See you later. And that is plan B down. And they also managed to, uh, to get all four up alive again. Oof, that is question mark removed from the game by Redline. They most certainly are doing clean, concise. They've got some idea that there is a team round with the flashbang first ones there. The follow-up, the transfer. No oh, three way. of them! Mexi! You dirty, dirty boy! That is disgusting! That is that is such a transfer. They should have been able to trade that, but Mixer is just too quick. Especially with the M4 as well. It's rare that you see that AT taking on some shots onto Besto. Scar team is out. Skate is out as well. Makes makes he actually gets a quad kill on them. Nades are coming in from red line. Ding is getting cleaned as well with some help from Face Clan. Red line six kills so far. That's good. I mean, there's there's failings to be brought up there, Martin. You know, we, I'm not going to take it away from Mexi. They they should have been able to just trade off on him. How in the world three players just went in one by one? And didn't do a single scratch to him. Well, they did. They almost killed him. But still, needless to say, to take on all four players and get a get an ace out of it. It's going to be good. Lookerux, no idea where Fex is. That's instant confirmation on the knock. The rest of Face Clan will now try and get involved in the fight. And Tropic is gone. Ten position for them. All the way at the north, VP still just holding it down. Oh, what in the... Good God! 
It's a bombardment. That's, oh, well, that's insane. That's, that's, that's how you kill Navi, I suppose. Yeah, you just clear it out and Mexi gets a free pass into the northern side of the circle, most likely. Eight kills for Mexi himself. And eight kills for Liquid total. That's uh, <laughs> an, an impressive feat so far for him. Potentially also get a few more kills. There's a good dip off for him, which takes him out of vision of VP completely. So the survivability factor is there, but he's just walking into a hornet's nest at the moment. It feels like he wants it. Doesn't get the knock this time to own. Oh. How's he? How has he even managed to knock that player? Oh, so, oh man. <laughs> it's just so good. Okay. With one of them down, there's problems now going towards the side of SMB. Bambaki will be the second one that falls. It looks like DA have got a full read on where SMB are. They can keep on punishing. They do. Huth will be the next one to fall victim. Jemty strikes and gets confirmation on the knock. Ends, by the way, have been lurking and lingering and trying to wrap around this fight all together. Apocalypse from first place down to seventh. Supermassive Blaze does not go any further. A little jump through the smoke will try and... At least uh, the movement that he's got, it stopped him from dying and being out in the open while he's fallen. But I don't know if Rustam Ma has the abilities to go and get him up on his feet. Being able to bag himself additional $1,250. Oof. He finds QB with a fantastic nade. More flashbangs being utilized here. Ooh, I was standing at a really good angle. Info coming in. Oh, Nail's gonna find AT. Shots coming in. They have to go fast. X finds one more. Oh, it's gonna be a really quick cleanup for them. I'm not sure. Oh, yeah, they got the time for the circle as well. No, yeah, Nate's coming out. Bujara, unfortunately, dropped the nade when he got knocked himself. Versus Pro moving in in between Face Clan and Mutiny. And did it to the Athletics there in the, on the southern side. Yeah, this split from DA and the, how the terrain works for them is going to be super oh my god perfectix <laughs> taking down Aetzi with that headshot from the mini one more shots coming out as well and that's actually face and teed out in fourth good consistency from them and we managed to stay full alive but Mutiny coming in putting on some pressure and they have to take it out perfect just taking on U6 as well and Leia and Granula going to be the last two players if DA decides to come in and third part of this, if Pixel is going to find Granula, Leash is going to find Perfect. This is a perfect timing for DA. If you DA, you're setting up to welcome VP with open arms, right? This is your time. There's a brief moment that you have that they're fixated in tunnel vision towards mutiny because that's what they have to do at the end of the day. They have to deal with this problem. Once they've dealt with it, they then got to deal with the final boss, which is DA. They control the circle. You cannot hey. stall here. You have the circle on your back. There is no time for respite. There is no time for just sitting around. DA is getting prepared for you to turn your attention to them and work your way into this circle. For VP, this couldn't be a worse circle, honestly. It's completely barren. Oh. It's open. Perfectix just nigh Escapes with his life. Oh, Never wow. mind. Vard, he's been throwing these things for years, causing Perfectix is down with no little health. A little bit of splash damage off the back of it will confirm the knock. And now they wait. Now oh, they just let them get into the open. Hold for a second and let rip. Here we go, VP. Welcome Pixel. to DA's house. This is their circle. This is their zone. Spyro, don't get me wrong. Gives a little bit as good as he gets on the hillside, but ultimately... This would have to be... Ooh, okay, that's interesting. But Tulin's with a belter of an aid onto Pixel. But that Vard has an angle. Quiet them down for all but a moment. But look at Vard's angle. You called it perfectly, Martin. He's right behind them. They're pushing down. They got, they got a lot of smokes. Utility being used completely correctly. And look at this gem T. Is it inside? Ooh, shots coming in. Oh... The tap. Is gonna turn. That's insane, but turns up. The Grozer gets the job done on Tabard. It removes one of them. Spyro's down low as well. Jemty's chasing this, but he's tagged up with the Molly. He's burning at the side. Spyro's there. Oh my word. This has turned head on heels completely for Digital Athletics. For some unknown reason, the Smokes, they've worked their way down. They've got behind them. They forced their way through enemy lines and VP is destroying DA. DA had all the time in the world to hold them. But that shot, that one clean shot onto Vard from Batulin's chain just changed the entire, entire landscape. VP should not have won that. They should not have won that.
Cause my mama no die from that shout I pray my dick get big as the apple time So I can fuck my world for 72 hours Goddamn